Hey guys, we've just collected the keys to this brand new six bed HMO in a very popular part of Birmingham. Uh, it was a property that I originally wanted to buy for myself. Uh, but our, one of our investor clients uh, was also looking for a deal uh, and I said I'll help her find one. Uh, so I gave her this one. And I must say, actually, we'll get back to the front uh, because this property was on the market in wine in, in in broad daylight so that's Davidson I must say a special thanks to John Smith from Davidson estate agent who was an absolute gent worked in the best interests of his client the vendor and also was an absolute professional when working with ourselves in fact this property was being on the market uh yeah on the open market he pointed me in the direction of it um took the viewing took it you know showed us around a few times got quotes and all, all that sort of stuff very patient very very good to work with we actually managed to get this property in the end and to get this bricks and mortar value which is you know, absolutely insane so a six bed hmo license for seven in an article four area in a very popular area of birmingham purchase at bricks and mortar value which yeah I mean that's that's really really good this is actually quite a decent decent size HMO as well it's a decent size property uh, literally I'll have you look uh, I'll show you guys around that's a reception room that's one bedroom so potentially we'll turn that into a bedroom as well and just reformat uh, reconfigure the place to, to optimize the space uh, maybe turn one of the other rooms into a reception room. So guys, if you don't know me already, my name is Tuna Gwyn. We let and manage high quality HMOs and single lets in and around Birmingham. We also source properties for ourselves and our clients. This one was given to our client. Purchased at bricks and mortar value. Again, absolutely insane. Because we had a, an offer, uh, actually we made an offer for a similar property uh, on this road for 125k more yeah so there you go uh, okay so this one bedroom so the beauty of this of this property uh, and on this deal in general is that we can just spruce it up a little modernize it maybe change the carpet the wall is actually really good condition and the bed, uh, sorry, the bed, the furniture is actually well dated. They're, they're very robust. Mattress we can change. And then, you know, liquor paint. And then we can just start the lettings process, start getting cash in for our landlord client. Alternatively, we can uh, gut it, uh, and turn it into uh, en suites and studios, and then re-let it as studios and art suites. So, you know, it's got the planning. So the, all the options are there. And also, if we're in the loft now, we're on the right, we're at the front of the property, which is over here, and that's two rooms. There's all that potential open space as well. So what we we'll do is we're gonna have to, not through here, and investigate that side of the loft to see if we can potentially turn that into uh, another room, another studio or flat as well. So yeah, plenty of opportunities uh, on this development. The beauty being it was purchased at bricks and mortar price. It's a six bed, so it's got planning for six, license for seven. Um, we can spend 5K, maybe 10K to spruce it up and then re-let it straight away so it's cash flowing. Um, it'll fill up this time of year, it'll fill up really, really quickly at very good rent. And then either wait around for a few years and then completely gut the place and turn it into six or seven ensuites and studios, or straight away we can convert it into ensuites and studios straight away, sorry, uh, straight away. Uh, and then uh, that should be done. See, we are in, the first of June now, so the first week of June, it will take, say, like three months, June, July, August. 
So we should be able to get this back onto market at the end or mid August and I get it tenanted for September, which is the busiest time of the year for lettings. Uh, and that's when you'll get the highest rent as well. And then, yeah, it's cash flowing straight away. So, you know, it's a really good strategy. It's a really good purchase. And again, I've got to really say thank you to John. John Smith from Davidson's set agent for firstly directing me to this deal uh, and also for being an absolute gent taking the viewings, uh, helping their client, his client, the vendor, and helping ourselves, the buyer, to complete on the purchase very quickly without any issues whatsoever. So we'll go ahead now, start the works, and then get it tenanted uh, pretty quickly. All right, guys, hopefully that's been helpful. Um, what is, I'll start doing the, the our, our investor, our client will make a decision on you know, if they want to keep it as is, tie it up and let it out, or just go for the full whack and turn them into six, seven studios and let them out, let them out. But I'll keep you guys posted out of the way and we'll, we'll probably most likely do video updates of what's going going on. All right, hopefully that's been helpful. I'll see you guys in the next one. All right, bye.